jungle. Tinubu blows hot, knocks Obasanjo over democratic statements. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, my wonderful people, my wonderful subscribers. How are you guys doing this morning? This is breaking news. News in details. The current state of Nigerian democracy has become a subject of blame, with the presidency pointing fingers at former President Olusha Gompasanjo. This assertion comes in response to Obasanjo's recent criticism of Western democracy, suggesting its failure to deliver good governance and development in Africa. In an interview with the Punch, Bayo Ononuga, the special advisor to President Bola Metinumbu on the former of, of information and strategy, insisted that Obasanjo bears responsibility for the prevailing democratic model in Nigeria. Ananuga urged that the democracy in practice today has its roots in direct inputs by Obasan Joe during his leadership roles. First, as a military head of state from the 1976 to 1979 and later as a civil president from 1999 to 20, 2007, the presidency stands revoked around the nation. The notion that Obasanjo introduced a poorly adapted model during his tenure as the head of state and president. Anonuga emphasized that Obasanjo ought to know that he brought this thing into Nigeria. He was the one who made us adapt, adopt it in 1979. He highlighted that Obasanjo's recent criti critics seems somewhat ironic, considering his instrumental role in shaping the country's democratic landscapes. According to Anonuga, Obasanjo's eight years governance period raised questions about the sustainability and costs effectiveness of the adopted democratic system. The special advisor suggested that if Obasanjo genuinely believes in his current critics, that he should advocate for a return to the parliamentary system. He also reminded about Nigerian practicing the, the parliamentary democratic left by the British until the military intervention in 1966. However, when the country sought to return to democracy, instead of reverting to the previous parliamentary system, it was Obasanjo who endorsed the recognition recommendation of the Constitutional Assembly, opting for the American-style democracy. Furthermore, Anonuga contended that Obasanjo's adoption of the presidential system was flawed as it replicated the form and structure without capturing its essence. He urged that Obasanjo during his presidency from 1999 to 2007 even attempted to modify the constitution, indicating a recognition of the shortcomings in shortcoming in the system he helped established. In essence, the presidency's response paints Obasanjo as a key player in the evolution of Nigerian's democratic framework, asserting that the current challenges stem from decisions made during his leadership. The exchange underscores the complicity and nuances surrounding the assessment of democratic practices and their impact on government and development in the African continent. Thank you viewers for listening to this news. Wow. According to reports, it was reported that Obasanjo brought what is happening to Nigeria. The hardship of facing democracy 
issue we are facing in Nigeria, that Obasan Jo is responsible for this. Well, it's been a long time Obasan Jo became the head of state and president of his country. Even if it's a cause of this, why can't the new president amend this? If truly he, he has come, if truly Tinubu has come to make Nigerian better, he should sacrifice his life for Nigerians. Fine, Obasan Jo has, has, he has done this and it's a thing of the past as we speak. So the new person that is coming should know that this is what he or she is coming to face or to solve. So he should not be complaining. Since he has the guts, the right to read the election to his favor. So he should be ready to waive any challenges that Nigeria is facing. It should be ready to bring peace to the country. So what is your take on this? You have editor from Onenuga accusing Obasanjo of bringing um, Obasanjo that the democracy in practice today has its root in direct impute by Obasanjo during his leadership role. So your comment concerning this news will be very much appreciated. Please don't hesitate to drop every of your comments down below the comment box. Click on the subscription button if you have not done that, as well as the bell button for more updates. Thank you and God.